Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Lectures and Lab Coats. My name is Sparks and as always I will be your lovely lab coated lecturing let's player for today. Uh, we're joined today by Kyle here from um, Tugwell TV and uh, to demonstrate something I've got right here which is uh, an arrow shield. So if Kyle would be so kind as to gently shoot me, <laughs> just, just gently, <laughs> there we go. So you can see that the arrow is definitely shooting me and it, it definitely hurt. Uh, uh, it's in your leg. Turn. Okay, there we go. So my health back up. Um, if I stand on this, this is my arrow shield. So um, if I stand on this, I'm going to get green particles around me. And if Carl tries to shoot me, you'll see that his arrows explode in a little puff of, in a little puff of um, beautiful light. And now the effects run off, so it hurts again. Ouch. And Carl can do the same thing. If you look at the arrow shield scoreboard variable on the side there, it actually counts down. So if I now try and shoot Kyle. The arrows do absolutely nothing, uh, and you can see the countdown is going three, two, one. Can I touch me? And then I can shoot oh, him oh, again. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah, that's basically basically how it works. Um, the the dark purple particles appear when the effect is about to run out. So <laughs> it's kind of fun. Uh, it could be useful for certain uh, power ups in maps, that sort of thing. <laughs> and the effect has run out again. Ow! Oh God! I don't know where I am now. Um, <laughs> so yeah, I will. Um, I'll. I'll say goodbye to Kyle, and then I'll explain how it all works. See you thanks. Guys. Thanks very much for joining us, Kyle. No problem, buddy. Bye bye. <laughs> so this works very simply. Um, there's two parts here, and the one on the left is not actually needed. And um, this is generating the particle effects, um, and uh, also counting down. Uh, until the shield stops working. So they're, they're not necessary. And actually, of these uh, five command blocks, only three are needed uh, to make this work, and two, two are kind of decorative. Um, so the first one down here is simply setting the space above it to air, and the one above here is setting the space below it to redstone block. All these commands will be in the description. Um, okay, so that's basically breaking and replacing this redstone block here over and over again, um, once every tick. So that's um, basically pulsing a clock every 20th of a second. Um, this command block here is killing the arrows when they get near you. Now it's very important that, that this is facing south. So from your design, the south face, uh, and you can see south is written just here on your screen, uh, the south face is um, evaluated last. So we want to, these two here are the um, these two here are the effects uh, and they need to be evaluated before the arrow is destroyed so this last face here is done last so what this is here doing and again this will be in the description is uh, executing on behalf of all players with an arrow shield scoreboard value of one uh, or more uh, it will kill all arrows within a radius of three so if I have an arrow shield of one or more let me just get a bow from the bow section there we go um, if my arrow shield value over there is more than one, then any arrow within three blocks of me will be killed. That's the slash kill at E type equals arrow R equals three. Uh, so very simple. Uh, that's basically the only three command blocks you needed. These two here to make the clock and then one back here to actually kill the arrows. Now, this one here is creating the fireworks spark effect. Now that one is um, it's just a little puff of smoke. Um, when the arrow is destroyed, which you can see there, the little white particle there. So it just kind of looks kind of nice. Uh, and the command is basically executing on the behalf of everyone with a score of arrow shield of one or more. Then on behalf of any arrows within range of them, um, creates a particle firework spark. And then these values, again, all in the description. And this one over here is just playing the fireworks blast, fireworks dot blast, blast sound. So you could place any sound you wanted here. Um, and that creates a sort of the bang when the arrows are destroyed. Um, so, yes, uh, very simple. And then over here, um, this one down here is counting down. So scoreboard players um, take away one from anybody with an arrow shield value of one or more. Uh, and this clock here is running at once a second. So that just counts it down nicely. Um, this one uh, up here is creating the happy villager particles, those are the green particles while the shield is running, and that's for everybody with a uh, arrow shield value of three or more. Um, and then finally, uh, this one here is creating the witch magic, uh, which is the purple particles for anyone with a uh, scoreboard value between 
one and three so that way when you first get the effect you get these green particles which lets the user know that they have have the shield running and when it gets to three the purple particles will start spawning which gives you a short warning that your effect is about to run out and lets you jump to cover that kind of thing uh, so very simple to do um and hopefully very useful i mean i have a i have an, a map in this server where there's a really long corridor and running down it completely unprotected you probably get shot so um I think that's going to be really handy. You can give people this effect using all sorts of different materials. Uh, you'll notice that I cannot shoot. Um, that's two things I should bring out. Uh, while the effect is running on me, I can't shoot either. And I would consider that like a, a trade-off, if that makes sense. Um, a sort of trade-off. Um, so that even though you're invulnerable to arrows, you can't shoot anyone else either. The other thing is this text. Um, now, this will probably be fixed hopefully, because uh, this is still snapshot stages, um, you can't currently hide that text, uh, which is unfortunate. Every time uh, an arrow is destroyed, you get playing effect firework spark, play sound firework blast, and kill the arrow. So um, that text will appear for the moment, but they should be turning that off uh, as a snapshot bug fix. So thank you very much for watching. I will see you all next time. Bye-bye. Uh, <laughs>